What is up guys, Austin Richo here, back again playing Jurassic World Evolution, continuing with building our version of Jurassic World. And as you can see, we're picking up kind of where we left off in the last episode. So we're getting all of the Pachycephalosaurids moved in, which I started incubating in the last episode. So we've got the Pachys and the Draco Rexes and the Stiggy Mollocks are now being all transferred into the pen. So hopefully they'll all live happy and healthy. I put three feeders in because I believe it's four dinos for every feeder. I want to say that's how it is, but I don't really know for sure if that's exactly the ratio, but I think we'll be fine there and everything. Then, of course, in the last episode, we did the ankylosaurids uh, little enclosure here, as you can see, with all the different types of ankylosaurids. And I went ahead and uh, went around and labeled their things, so of ankylo you know, ankylosaurids. I need to do the herbivore valley, so pachycephalosaurids. I need to figure out what these things would be called, the struthiomimuses and arctheornithomimus. Then over here we got the Ceratopsians, which is what we're going to be working on today. So we can come down over here and start. Um, let's start off with, no we did trike. So everything but Triceratops is what we're doing today. So it looks like our first one is the Chasmosaurs. Which I think I've fully maxed out their thing. Let's do that one first. Yeah, so it has a 10% chance. I was hoping to decrease um, the possibility, but I think I'm going to do four of each because I think that'll um, fulfill, but we have one because I think they need three. Yeah, they need three. So we've got that set, the Chasmosaurs. Then we've got the Pentaceratops, which I don't know if I have those need three also do they all need three you could just do three two two and haven't done it yet that may be three so I may just do three of each um, let's go ahead and see if we can just do one oh, where's the hatchery capacity hopefully they won't fail too much We'll go ahead and start off with our Chasmosaurs up here. Oh yeah, we already chose the Rainforest one. Now we'll choose another. Of course, doing all the fun. You know, this stuff is... So we have Arid, Tundra, Alpine. We'll do Alpine. And then whatever that lower one was. Not the very bottom. This one, Arid. We'll do that one as well. So we got the Chasmosaurs going in there, then we'll come over here, do the same thing. Hopefully they won't fail, I mean they have a, a good chance of failing, but hopefully it won't be too bad for some of these. So we got the Chasmosaurs, then I forget what the next one was, the Pentaceratops. I was going to say I assume they're modified, but I guess not. Oh look, one already failed. Of course it did. So that one though was the whatever that color the rainforest. Let's try it again. See if they fail again. I wish there was. I don't know if there is like a no fail option in here. Let's go ahead and just modify. I assume I've already got them all set up. The ones that I do have. Oh no, oh no, that's the one I got. 166. Ooh, there's 188. 210, we're getting over 200. Gonna have long living dinos. 230, there we go. Oh, and I didn't choose a color. Oh, another one. Yeah, I may, this may not work very good. I think I'll go with these four colors, so I'll just... Oh no, I'm doing three. forgot about that, so we'll go with Woodland first. If these all just fail, I may, like I said, just have to restart everything. And our last one. Wetlands. Okay. So this one was the Arid. 
So we need to do some arid patterns. So once we get done these going, which like I said, may have issues doing because they're failing. Um, we can start working over here on the carnivore, which I need to see how many carnivores. I do have this one I said would be the T-Rex. And then so over here, I do want to add a ham and creation, but I don't know where I want to put it exactly. I was thinking somewhat over this way. So let's take that off. I want to shorten it. Now we'll do a fat one like that. And right in the center we will put a viewing gallery. Let's see if we can get it straightened up to this part here. Oh, that's pretty good. Looks pretty centered, at least as centered as I could probably get it. And then now let's go with enclosures, or with the stuff we'll build a fence off of that. Oh no. Just attach it there. Oh no, because I was going to make this even bigger for a reason. I'm going to have to even fix this anyway, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Because it's not going to work exactly how I wanted it to. I forgot about that. Shoot. Okay. Let's figure out which one it was that died. So it was a woodland pattern pentaceratops. Penta. And we need woodland. I think these are pretty much done. They're all going to succeed at least, which is good. Okay, so we're going to... Uh, I don't know. So I'm going to delete this. Delete that. Okay, now let's try... Delete this road here and we'll put it back again. Just a short one though. And then we'll make it big once we I figure out what I'm gonna do for sure. So let's straighten this up here. I can't get it. There we go. Okay, now let's bring our walls back. Like that. There we go. And then... Hmm.
Come on. Why is everything gotta cause issues here? There we go. So it's not gonna be exactly how I wanted it. But it'll work and then we'll just, I guess. Divide right down the center maybe. And we'll do it kind of at an angle. Sure, we'll just do that. Oh, I guess that's not that good. Separate it. I think uh, camera's going everywhere. Okay, it did separate it. And then we'll add the doors. So over in the smaller area will be the um, Indoraptor, and then this side will be the Indorex. We'll be over into this side, and then of course we can go along and put all sorts of things along. So I think they're all done now, yes. Release all of those. Ah, it failed again. Once this is done, I may not do the same thing again. I think that was the woodland one. Get those released. Okay, so let's now add our little viewing galleries. Pull it close. I want as many as we can on these. Shoot wrong ones. And then we'll do tall ones over on this side. Is that a weird hill? I don't like how that hilled up like that. Oh well. Sure, we'll do that. Didn't do the same sort of thing on this side. Try and get this one centered there. We'll go ahead and add another one since it's a real short, small area on this side. Like that. So I just want everyone to be able to see the dinos in the park. There we go. I'm gonna have to just release these two, switch the thing back to success rate and try again with this stupid thing. Let's go ahead, these should all be, oh shoot, no, not what I wanted. Okay. Again, switching this back up. Now let's go with... So we did Pentaceratops. Now it's Cyanoceratops. One of my favorites in the park. So we're going to do three. So we'll do Step. And I believe I've got it maxed out. They don't have many options. Oh no, that one was higher. 66. Maybe I do need to check these. Okay, it looks like we're pretty much all good. Yep. And then we will choose. Let's 
Dead, maybe? I thought- I don't remember what the first one it was I did. Okay, jungle and step. So there are two different ones, which is good. Let's do that pentaceratops again. Yeah, it's got the same thing still. And incubate it. And then we'll do... Go ahead and just do the other cyanoceratops. So we did that one and we will do, do want alpine, tundra, or coastal. We'll do alpine. Transport these guys over here now to their new home. Probably need that another feeder into there, so that's those three. Okay, so now we can come back over here. Really, it failed. What is going on? I know it's got a zero percent viability, but <laughs> come on. Go ahead and take this one down a little. We'll do it to that one. Oh, I thought it had a better chance than the three. So hopefully that'll figure that whole thing out. I don't know how I want to connect this. Do I just want to do straight on? Sure. We'll try that. And then from here, we'll do straight out to meet up with this one. I like that little angle right there. We'll leave that. This one we also do straight out. Probably not matched exactly, but it's going to be good enough. Let's connect all of these. There we go. Now I have to get power. Oh my god, that thing failed again. Oh. This Pinoceratops is driving me insane. What do we do if we nullify it out? 14%. Sounds good to me. Hopefully that won't fail now. Oh yeah, that's Sinoceratops is ready. How about over here? Sinoceratops. And a Sinoceratops. Good enough. Now let's knock these things out. Sinoceratops. Sinoceratops. Wait for that other Pinta to come out. Okay, come on for the next one. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Should be good. We got these guys chilling out over here. All having fun. At least I hope so. Okay, so now let's try to add... So it looks like to cover all of these. There we 
go. We'll hook that one up. Then where was that one over? I'm trying to figure out how I want to connect this one. We're gonna put this right. I just want it straight up a little. There, good enough for that one. I don't know. It looks like I can't really connect that one. Okay. Let's do the Cynoceratopsies now. Asset. Asset collection request received. Acknowledging asset collection request. Yes, I don't think that's done yet. Okay, now let's look at what's next. So we did Cynoceratops, Nexus, Didorachosaurus. So we've got Rainforest, Jungle and Wetland will be the order that we go in. Let's see if we can do any better. I doubt it. Okay, and we've got, see like that one's what I was expecting, like the 42% one for the Styracosaurus stuff. That's what I was expecting to deal with on these. Things still not done yet. Let's go and get those two knocked out. And in here we'll, oh no. Do the upgrades. We'll do success rate, success rate, and success rate. And then we will do, of course, we will do the Indominus Rex first. There we go, Indominus Rex. What color do we want to do? Probably, yeah, the Rainforest one. I assume we've got it all modified out and everything. Oh no. Let's see how old we can get it to be. I doubt though we'll do very good because of the, it's already got negative, you know, so much. Okay, I don't care about that right now. And let's see, well, it looks like, yeah, it's not gonna get any older. Looks like, yeah, we already had it. It was just that one, probably from the last thing. So it's got negative 14. Let's see if it fails, which it probably will. Then we will do the Indoraptor. What color do we want the Indoraptor to be? Let's try the Vivid just to see. Oh, it's not been modified at all. Oh, shoot, I missed one. 81. 101, 121, 41, it's just adding by tens, 61, it's going to buy 20 every time, no 82 that time, so 21, 209, 209, and our last one here, 229. With negative 33. I'm pretty sure it's not going to work. I don't know why it says that, but let's just go ahead and do it. If they fail, they fail. These are only one dino. Okay, there we go. Pinoceratops released. Let's go ahead and chopper that one down. I hate the view. There we go. So 
Let's wait for that. How are the Steric Sorcerer almost done? Let's go in here. Just add these feeders. We'll add... A permanent feeder here. So that way it'll be in the out where everyone can see, you know, from here and all of those. And then we will add, also add a goat feeder, maybe just hiding over back in here. Just so we got some goats. And then we'll add some trees, even though I don't think they like too many trees. We'll just add trees. Just kind of uh, corner it off from the other one. Then we'll add some water. There we go. And I think this set it. Get out of there. There we go. And yes, the Styracus sources are done. Then we can do our other Styracus source. Come on. And we'll move our Pentaceratopses over here now. Picking up asset. Did I not? I swore I had a thing to knock that one out. Then we'll go back in with Sterak Source. I think we're going down one. Yeah, wetlands. We're going to the wetlands. Who's got a disease? Who's a sick dino? Transit has commenced. Cure that sick dino. Yeah, that's the only sick one. How about over here? Chasmosaur is doing good. Sinoceratops is doing good. Yeah, those are the only two we've got so far. Now let's work on this side. Add trees again. Come on, trees, go. I want to say usually raptors like trees and everything, but I don't know if indoraptors, because I've never had one, so I can't tell you. Put that one, then we'll do also a goat feeder as well back in. Just kind of want to hide it somewhere. Just put it right there. Surprised I haven't got fail messages on either of those yet. Okay, come on. Asset collection request so we got that other Steric source being done in there, I believe. Asset has been what do we got left? Tor sources is our last one. Have I worked on these before? Yes, I have. So we'll do woodland. Step and rainforest. Oh no, our disease is spreading. And we should be good on that, yes. Change the color to rainforest. And there we go. She no, where'd that one go? Adding task. Request acknowledged. Well, I had a second Ranger team on him as well. No problem. Confirming task. Just to try and hurry that up. That one's about done. Let's go ahead and get our two Starak sources, and this one should be about done. Oh, it looks like we've added another one, too. Setting additional task. There we go. 
Styracosauruses are done now. Pick up them and put them over here now. Acknowledging asset collection request. En route to collect the asset. There we go, all the strike sources are now the in the pin. What was this? Tor sources. So let's do the other tour source in here to get it going and done so we can be done for today with the step. There we go. So I'll wait a second for that to get done. And um, once that's done, I'll bring it right back. And once they're in the pin and everything to show them off. So I'll see then. And so they are all in their pin now. So we got all of the ceratopsids over here. So let's go in and look at them. So right here we got a Taurosaurus, Pintosaurus, or Pintoceratops, sorry. Taurosaurus, Styracosaurus, Sinoceratops, Pinta. Oh, it's so loud. A Taurosaurus sitting there eating. Chasmosaur. Uh, Pinta. It's got all sorts of different little dinos going. Oh, there's a lot up here at the top for some reason. So the Chasmosaurus have a lot of these have population issues, but thankfully they won't break out. I forgot to check to see if they were comfort with everything else. I assume they are. Um, because usually things like this aren't too bad, it's just population. Yeah, it looks like the grasslands and everything are all fine. Yeah, I think that's each type. So I think we got four, so a Tora, Pinta, Staraka, Chasma, and Sino. Is that five maybe? I don't know. Hopefully we got enough feeders though for everybody and nothing's going to go wrong there. Let's take a look from this viewing platform. Oh, that's a good view. You can see a lot of them all together there roaming around. That is super cool. So that is going to be it for today where we did our Ceratopsids uh, pin over here with every type of Ceratops. It's so funny seeing this one. It's like he's trying to reach over into that pin or something. Uh, but we got all our Ceratopsids over here all gathered up in a herd looking all nice and cool so we got our Tauras so they're all talking together I wish they'd interact with like the Pintas and Sinos stuff oh look at that pretty Sino those are so my favorites they're so cool but I hope you enjoyed this episode for today if you did be sure to let me know in the comments down below leave a thumbs up for me and don't forget to subscribe to the channel to see me continue to build my version of Jurassic World where I'm hoping to get every single dino in the park here oh yeah I forgot to check on the packies here that we did at the beginning there they all are. We got a Packies. We got a Stiggy. Ah, oh, cute little Stiggies. They're also my favorite dinos. And then we got Draco Rexes over there. We should I should have probably put the feeder over here. I may do that real quick. Add the feeder over to this way just so it gets people. Not that it really matters. Because people over here can't see it. So I'll just draw people over to that side. But that's going to be it for this episode today. Thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and we will see you in the next episode.